side behind that, and the linebackers are out of position. Give again to Smith. Good running room over here. This will be the 13th play of the drive, and it's fourth and goal. The key slow mesh, little flip, batted into the air. Another interception. It's picked up by Makai Blackman, and Blackman stops the threat. By USC. You think Alex Grinch, the new defensive coordinator, is going to be proud of that? Great effort there by Blackman, who's another transfer portal guy from Colorado. Eyes in the backfield, watching that quarterback. He puts it up in the air where his big target has a chance to... Evan Stanford been able to control the ball some. Bit of a shoulder issue, and it appears that he took a shot that'll... Slow him down again. That's slow. He's going to bring a corner blitz from the boundary. So that's one way to take away the slow mesh. Slow mesh. He gives it. Safeties are back. Thinks not waiting for a team or two to lose in front. Well, even at the top, I moved Georgia to the top of the rankings last week. Yeah. Any of these nice calls on my call sheet. Coletto's in the game as an offset fullback from the 47 of Oregon State. And again, Nolan taking a shot. For Lindsay, and that is picked. What a play by Makai Blackman! Big time league. Well, it's man-to-man -man coverage. He's running with Lindsay the whole time, right in his hip. Little grab there. Little grab there. But how about the catch there, Tyjon Lindsay? <laughs> As great as he was, Jones pressure throws short right to Valaday, and he'll be gang tackled. And number 18 there again, Eric Gentry was flying all over the field. Yeah, give a lot of credit to you taking the ball away like that. Well, they haven't taken it away tonight. Jones on third down. Going to heave it down the sideline in coverage, contact, and no flag. Incomplete, intended for Brian Thompson. Guy Blackman was reigning Balitnikov award winner. Second and eight for Wazoo. Ward, space, Ward to the 40. Garoa trying to do his Toy Pelotu impression. <laughs> oh boy. Get it to Farrell and he just threw him right into the arms of Makai Blackman. And Eric Gentry and there's a flag in the 30. Black, but just phenomenal splitting, splitting two offensive players. It's play action on third and one. A lot of time. Rising heaves it to the end zone and batted away by Blackman. This is how you do it, and Makai Blackman's been doing it for a long time. Six years of college experience. He's six foot tall. He's given up five inches, and he knows the only chance for when USC's defensive line is bearing down on him. Rising to throw, and how about the... Look at Blackman right up in McMillan's face up top. That's where the door is going. Man, that was... That's pretty good football. That's one off. And he's been terrific against the USC Trojans. He'll throw it this time up the seam route. Second down and 10 at the 39. Thompson Robinson with time. Sideline picked off. Blackman out of bounds around the 30. Makai Blackman just stepped in front, trying to move back towards the sideline. Watch as he makes his move right here, and now he's trying to fall out of his route, and the ball is just thrown way too far inside. And that's why you've got guys unblocked in the backfield. Second down and 16. Thompson Robinson to the sideline to Jones, and Jones just flipped. Thompson Robinson, sideline, juggled it. He used his weapons down here in the red zone. It's the wide receiver, Jet Sweep, and Dixon is trampled. Eric Gentry got in there along with Makai Blackman. Right in your face right here, and he's got to beat the block. Adon Kincaid, who didn't practice much this week at all, sucked it up and gotten it out to be here today. Behind the numbers, second and 19. They go empty for rising. He throws sideline and nearly... Now, why do I feel Buckeye Nation on the edge? of their couch. This throw is complete by rising. It's per on 14 carries. It's a very healthy average. Adding to the total. Ball came out. It's loose. Trojans say they've got it. 
He put it on the ground. A rare miscue, and it's USC football. That's why he was all Pac-12 this year. Back with more after this.